Hey guys, I just wanted to give you an update. There are some curious people what happens to the watches at the beach. Oh wow. I found one on the beach right here. It's a six year old submariner. Looking pretty darn good. Um, he said where it's supposed to be. The beach. See? Made for the ocean. Um, it's about six years old. I'm not saying it's in great shape as far as blemishes go. But that's not because of the beach. That's because I hit it around all the time. I got a couple scratches here and there. But the basil, everything else looks great. The crystal looks fabulous. No fading whatsoever. And it's been living on the beach for the last six years. I kid you not. Salt, sand, ocean, no problems. Kind of got like sandy right now. I gotta go in and dip it in. Let's do that. So I'm gonna go ahead and dip it in, wash it out, and put it back on. All right. See how much sand is there. Here it is. See, looks like new. Actually, um, I'm gonna be honest, when I get home, I rinse it with um, fresh water because you just don't want that salt water build up on it. Not, nothing's gonna happen, but it's just lasts you longer without cleaning. All you have to do is just uh, get a lukewarm water and just rinse it out. Um, if you want to use a toothbrush, that'll be okay. You can use a little bit of soap if you want, that'll be okay. But I don't do any of that. All I do is uh, use it at the beach, on sand, in ocean, go home, rinse it. And I've been doing this for six years. If anybody is telling you the opposite, that this watch is not gonna stand all this, there's your proof. I mean, exceptional if I had to do this all over again I'll buy the same watch I don't think there is any better watch for the beach love it